is up you guys Megan here with another video and before jumping into the actual reaction I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm doing a little bit of like a follow spree or something I don't know what you want to call it but basically just make sure that you're subscribed and you follow me on Instagram and then DM me like a screenshot or like a picture of the fact that you like subscribe to me and then also like I'll check if you followed me and then just like message me something that you liked um, about the video something that you don't like um, want to see me react to have suggestions or like if you want me to vlog something or if you like just have a comment on the video itself like if you like the person that I'm reacting to and want to talk about then I'll have a conversation with you and I will also follow you back on Instagram for this video we're gonna be taking a look at Pentatonix yeah I know I'm bringing them back. I haven't looked at them for a while and I haven't even like followed them in a while. I feel like I'm out of touch a little bit. But they posted this new evolution of Ariana and like, oh my god, I had to react to it because I think I had a little bit of like a... I, I'm like a late bloomer and like the Ariana like fandom I feel like I enjoyed her music but only whenever it was like played on the radio or if it was like a really popular song and it was like going around like I would listen to it and I'd be like excited about it but like I never actually sat down and listened to any of her albums and I think the new one is the first time that I actually listened to her album and I became a huge fan and I'm obsessed with her and I feel like her whole brand and everything is just amazing and I love her. I thought that I would react to like their rendition of the evolution of her. I always like these types of videos and I especially love when Pentatonix does this because um, they just have this like unique flair especially because it is an acapella group so um and i'm so familiar and i love pentatonix so much um so i thought i would have to react to this but um yeah i guess i don't have anything to say right now but uh without further ado let's get ready here we go Oh my god. Wait, I haven't seen them in so long. What happened to Mitch's hair? Oh my god. Oh my god, wait. Oh, I forgot about this song. Oh, I forgot about this song too. Whoa! Oh my god, I forgot about all of them. And these songs. There's so many bangers in here. Oh my god. Wait, I have Christmas. Oh my god. Like, I legitimately have two spots right now. Oh wait, 
so many moments in there where I just like freaked out because I didn't know what was happening first of all um let's just take a moment of like appreciation for like Mitch because what um I feel like he's the one that consistently shocks me because um from where he started um and then where he is right now and how his range like I just can't Oh my god, like he can take Ariana's place, like for, like, I, I just, that's how, that's how wide his range is. They've changed a lot. I don't know if this is just me, like not having watched them and listened to them for a while, but I feel like they've changed a lot. They used to play it safe almost, but like now, they kind of do their own thing. It, they make a mix out of it, and that's so like interesting to me just because we're living currently in the day and age of like soundcloud right so we as like my generation we listen to soundcloud and like variations of the same app um where like streaming services are like taking over like people from their homes can just create these like awesome mixes post it and then like go viral essentially with all of that it's hard to keep up because like everything is so digitalized so if someone wants to make a mix, like you don't even, you can become famous by becoming your own DJ essentially, if that makes any sense. So like you can have two un original songs or multiple original songs, mash them up together, post it and people will be listening to you. And um, it's hard to compete with that if you're not like on the radio. So the fact that they're able to do this and um basically like change to make it their own version of SoundCloud is honestly incredible and I'm so proud of them and I'm so happy that I reacted to them and it just makes me so happy and I feel like I'm gonna listen to this like on a daily basis now. I would have to listen to it a couple times to actually break it down. Um, let me know in the comments and we'll have a little discussion. That's literally all I can say and I just love them so much. Like, oh my god. It just makes me so happy that like they've reached this level that's pretty much all i got for this video um if you guys want me to react to similar things just let me know in the comments or dm me or message me um and i'll definitely like add that to my list um i'm not gonna be doing only reactions starting now i feel like i kind of want to expand and see what else i can do i know i've been saying this for a couple months um whenever i was like you know kind of active on youtube but i think i actually am gonna try and do more like vlogging style more like maybe i don't know bits or like sketches or I don't even know yet like I just want to experiment or maybe do some like sort of artsy thing or maybe like I don't know do my own sort of like covers and stuff but that's pretty much all I got if you're new don't forget to hit that subscribe button um and join our family I am back if you are you know 
not subscribed and you're not new, I would definitely still recommend you subscribe. But yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Go follow me on Instagram and Twitter too. I haven't gone on Twitter in a while, but definitely follow me on Instagram and talk to me on there. I'm going to be active on there a lot more as well. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I got. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are having a great day or night depending on whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.